<laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's me, Trickett. And yes, this is another amazing edition, guys, of Wake Up With Trickett. And uh, I salute, as always, the greatness and the divinity in each and every one of you guys. <laughs> Oh, what an awesome, <laughs> super Saturday morning it is this morning. And man, I am just feeling great. It's amazing. I feel wonderful. And I'm just laughing <laughs> because I was just thinking, you know, guys, before I get started, let me first and say thank you for hanging out. Thank you for, you know, just, just being part of my community. And with that being said, let's grow together now. Check this out. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. Hey, um, uh, I was just thinking, I don't know why, but you know, I'm always thinking about stuff. <laughs> so I was just thinking about all the different energies, right? <clears throat> that people embody. Like, cause these are all your choices, right? No, you didn't create the states. God did. No, you didn't create the the level of states you know that's all been created the maze has been created people the game the dollhouse everything <laughs> like the apartment that's already furnished it's already been created everything you need everything you want everything you can ever desire to want or imagine it's already been created right <laughs> and i was just thinking you got people then that are like embodying these energies that are just mad at people for just being confident right like with all this stuff going on in the world right <laughs> you get people mad at people for just like hey like one energy talks to another energy and says hey what's up and the other energy's like what's up <laughs> and the other energy's like why are you looking like that <laughs> the other energy is like, I can't stand that person over there. <laughs> and the other energy is like, why, man, they seem pretty positive on whatever they're doing. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't bother nobody. <laughs> like, what's up? <laughs> and the other energy is like, yeah, I know. <laughs> they never done nothing to me. I just don't like the way they, they think. <laughs> You're like, really? <laughs> <laughs> like with everything going on in life <laughs> out of your um, productive busy day <laughs> you have so much time on your hands that someone's positive thinking not negative thinking, right? Not someone you have to worry about. <laughs> Lock your doors. <laughs> Got to worry about if you have a $20 bill laid out that it may be missing when, when they leave. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that individual. And that's the person that you're sitting there <laughs> all upset about rocking that energy like it's like fashion i mean people be walk, rocking that 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 energy that negative energy like fashion you know what i'm saying so so the other energy was like oh oh i get it so you're rocking that hater today huh you got that designer hater gear on <laughs> how many people folks are rocking that designer hater gear Every day, they just get up with it. They be like, yeah, you know, <laughs> let me put on my designer hater gear today, <laughs> hater gear today, right? <laughs> and let me go out there and, uh, and, 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 you know, and rock it. And they have no problem rocking it. They show it off all day long like they are a model on the runway. <laughs> Oh, man, it's crazy, right, guys? I'm laughing because it's just funny. I'm not laughing at people. I just laugh at the energies they embody. Because then when you, if you embody a clown suit, yes, you're going to make me laugh, okay? Because you're a clown, all right? And you're going to do things that clowns do. And so you're going to entertain me. And I'm going to laugh. <laughs> 
But if you take off the clown suit <laughs> and you put on something else, and then, you know, obviously I'm not going to be laughing like, you know, what you wear in the clown suit because you're not going to be doing things like a clown does, right? <laughs> so anyway, guys, oh, man. So, yeah, they be rocking that hater ration gear. Like, like, I'm telling you, like, like the new designer for real, real. <laughs> and you know they got it on, right? Because you can always tell when they're wearing it. They always have that same, that same personality, right? Don't smile. <laughs> they're very, they're rarely happy. They've really practiced the fake one, you know, the fake smile. They've, they've, they've worked on that. You know, the time and energy they put in <laughs> working on their little fake smile. Like, Hey, does this one make me look like I live in a high vibration? <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't think, I don't think my teeth are wide enough for that one. They might, they might be able to see through me. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Let me practice that smile again. Does this one make me look like I'm now living in a high vibration? Because <laughs> you know you will have those 3D low vibing people, what I call, you know, living below the surface. <clears throat> For some reason, they always want to see what's going on on the surface. They always want to like, well, what's going on up there? <laughs> Why do you care? <laughs> you're rocking, you're rocking your hater gear. They don't wear hater gear. Matter of fact, it's banned up there. You can't even roll, you can't even wear it. You know what I'm saying? You don't get to embody that energy. And then everybody's on, 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 on intuitive levels. You know what I mean? So you can't even get away with nothing without somebody being able to read you, spot it out. Like, why do you care what's going on up there? Why don't you just stay where you're at <laughs> until you're really, 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 really ready to just, you know, Get rid of that <clears throat> hater gear that, you know, has you mean mugging everyone. Let me look serious. Like, why are you looking serious, bro? You just got paid. I know, but it's the, it's the energy I'm embodying. This is how I have to do it. <laughs> this is how I have to, this is how I have to be. This is the image I want to give out. This is the energy I want to put out. You're like, ah, oh, all right. <laughs> You're sure that gear hasn't taken over you? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like a Twilight Zone movie. Like the ventriloquist, the ventriloquist becomes the puppet. Now the puppet's, you know, controlling him or her. <laughs> That's the one pulling the strings. <laughs> oh, man, guys. I'm telling you, it's crazy, right? People get mad at people for the least little thing. And, 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 and there's, you know, people dying and sick and they could be figuring out how they can help heal people, help heal the world. I mean, at this point, they need to heal themselves, right? Like people don't believe that they need to do the shadow work. That, that shadow, who's your shadow? You know, when you walk by a wall and it's a sunny day and you see your shadow every time you move, it moves. Every time you do your little thing, it does its thing. That. You need to heal that person, but that's the, you're, you're getting a, like a little, like, um, uh, uh, <clears throat> matter of, you know, it's like metaphorically speaking, you know, with the little image of the shadow, but you're getting a little glimpse of your inner self on the outside. But that version of you is your jacked up version, unfortunately. That's the one that has you making your wrong decisions. That's the one that has pride written all over it. You know when you put on that. Come on, guys. We all know when you rock that energy of pride, you're like, yeah, you know, let me see what I'm going to wear today. Hmm. I'm going to put on this energy of, oh, girl, I like this one. This one's called pride. Ooh. You know, I got to put on pride and then I want to wear them shoes called ego. Oh, girl, I got pride and I'm rocking them new. These are new designers right here. These are ego shoes. Yeah, ego. I'm rocking them egos right now. <laughs> uh, and then they go out and I promise you, <laughs> they're the best. Look, let me tell you guys, when you guys embody, when any, any of us embody these energies, you become... 
the best actor or actress in that energy. I promise you don't even have to practice. It's like you instantly know, <laughs> you know that energy. You know how to flow in that flow. It's like instantly you know how to um, walk in that frequency instantly you don't have to be like okay well let me see no no it's none of that you're like instantly boom it's like what Donald's <laughs> on the Avengers you know it's like snapping the fingers <laughs> and instantly you just become that energy you know what I'm saying so whatever it is positive or negative you instantly become it <laughs> right and so you just have people embodying these, you know, they're rocking the ego shoes and they got the pride outfit on and, you know, and then they just go out there with that. And then, you know, you, 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 you try to talk to them or, or whatever. And then they have to show you what they're wearing by their attitude, through their attitude. They'll show you what, what energy they're embodying. You're just like, oh, so that's what you decided out of all. Oh, the things that you could have picked out today you decided to put on some ego shoes and rock some pride outfit today <laughs> you know what that tells me folks honestly do you know what that tells me <laughs> you don't have a friend in the world <laughs> why do you say that trick it because you had no one, nobody to come and tell you to your face <laughs> that no, no girl, no, 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 <laughs> you do not look good in them ego shoes and you do not look good wearing that pride. <laughs> you need to put that jug right back up. <laughs> You need to put on some, I know everything is working out for me. I'm walking at a high vibration and uh, probably go get that scarf over there that says, I'm expecting something good coming my way today. And you rock that outfit and I guarantee you, you're going to be shining. They don't want to wear that outfit. <laughs> They're like, man, I don't want to wear that one. What? I need, I need to feel like I'm better. I need to feel like I don't want to wear that outfit. That outfit's going to make me feel like a feeling that I want, but I'm scared to embody it. <laughs> like that's that outfit. I just keep walking by and keep telling myself I can never afford it, but it's free. <laughs> uh, it's free. A big old sign on it says free. But you know, when you don't want to see something, you know what I'm saying? Like if you have somebody like doing you wrong, you're in a toxic relationship, they may be cheating, stealing, whatever. And you know it, and then you just pretend like you don't see it. <laughs> oh, gosh, man. Love them all, right? <laughs> Love them all. <laughs> But stop trying to jump on that elevator, folks. Stop trying to embody these negative, energetic bodies and then want to wear it for, for today or for a few years or a whole lot of people will live and die without ever knowing self-love, unfortunately. But because you never really die, die, well, you know, <clears throat> then they'll just... In the next life, you know, hey, I'm rooting for you. Hopefully you'll get it right. <laughs> because if not, uh, you'll just keep going through it. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying that, you, you know, you can always embody the energy you want to embody for free. Look, in, in this realm here, everything, nothing, look, everything Everyone has the same options. You know, everybody loves to say I have options. I have options. Oh, I have options. Uh, I'll treat you like an option. I have an option. Oh, before I move over here, let me check my other three placements. Let me check my other five, my other two, my whatever. <laughs> Look, you can embody any energy you want if that's the energy you want to embody embody that energy but you have to you have to understand folks that whatever energy you decide to wear for today whatever whatever designer 
<laughs> Ego shoes, pride jacket, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Whatever you want to wear today for that day, you just got to remember that there will be karma attached to it. So it's like layaway, right? Meaning like <clears throat> all that crap you talk today, all that stuff you put out there today, all that negative you put out there today, you didn't make it right by the end of the day? And then guess what? That layaway, that was just got laid up for you, honey boo-boo. <laughs> that just got put up for you. That's all. It just got put up for you. It has your name on it, the date you put it out, all that stuff. It's it's your creation. <laughs> Well, whether you know it or not. And then, you know, you're going to just go live your life, right? The way you do, you know, just however I want to live it, doing what I want to do, right? And then the I that produced that forgets what you've done, you know, because you're wearing ego. So ego has you talking crazy, feeling, doing things, only caring about, you know, you or whatever. Ego's a selfish type of energy, right? And so, um... And ego's also like the Pandora box, right? Because ego will open up a whole sorts of negative um, influences. You know what I'm saying? It's like when people say like, we, you know, back in the days, people would be like, you know, everybody tries to scare people. Weed is the gateway drug or marijuana is the gateway drug. And then they would show you people flipping out and all that. And you're like, really? On what? <laughs> uh, folks, man, everybody's trying to get you to wear some type of energy, right? They're like, yeah, will you guys please put this, put this energy of fear on? We need you to wear this. We need you to believe this. We don't need you to do no research. We don't need you to check into nothing. We need you to just... Take it, hook, line, and sinker, bl blindfold it, and let's just roll with it. <laughs> and unfortunately, so many people will just embody that energy and roll with it. And then later down the line, thank you, God, that, you know, we wake up. You know what I'm saying? And then we're like, we look around and we go, you know what? I don't really like what I, what my closet looks like. That's when we have to clean out the closet from what? From all those negative energies, all that claw, all that stuff we put on. We're like, nope, ain't wearing this no more. Nope, ain't wearing this no more. But the thing about this is that those energies never go nowhere. You can clean them out mentally, meaning I can move them from point A and I can slide them over to point B, but those energies are states. And the state of poverty will always be here when you die, when your folks die, when generations come and go, poverty will always be here for the people that want to embody poverty, a poverty mindset, you know, a negative mindset, poverty lifestyle, a person can be rich uh, monetarily, but then broke its all get out mentally. You know what I'm saying? Addicted to lying, addicted to negativity, bunch of codependencies, a hot mess, but you might have a few dollars. You know what I'm saying? Like folks, what energy you got? We got to, you, we got to stop doing this. You know what I'm saying? And folks, yeah, uh, look, let's just keep it 100. We're wearing these outfits every day, disguising them as somebody else, disguising it as something else it's under a different name. I don't want to put no one's name on it because I don't want that seed to be put on nobody's name. So forget that. <laughs> Plus, I like the designer. <laughs> so, but I'm not trying to rock no, no, you know, ego shoes or, you know, the pride outfit for the night. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you look good, girl. Yes, you rock. I got, got this whole pride outfit. Yep, looking great. <laughs> yeah, you, you, yeah, 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 you are. <laughs> and then you got the other side of people, right? That are, these are people, look, it's like club night. Check this out. Just hit me right now. I got a quick download. Check this out. It's like club night, right? <laughs> And the low vibrational people are all, all embodying all the energies 
that you know are like caution signs left and right. It's like if this was a football game, it, it, you should be hearing that whistle blow all night long because there's so many red flags, right? You know what I'm saying? Like you can tell, you know, they're embodying the, the, the energy of lying, of, oh, I'm a player now, uh, of I can get anyone or everyone wants me. I don't know. I guess that's supposed to be attractive or something. Um, or whatever, you know what I mean? Like they just, that's ego. So ego's doing what ego does, right? <laughs> As you feeling like you're just like, yeah, eh, whatever. I guess to a certain extent it's healthy, but then to a certain extent it just becomes super unhealthy depending on how it makes you treat other people, right? So, you know, you're wearing these, this, the, 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 this outfit and this is how these people in the underworld are preparing to go out clubbing. You know, they're, they're putting on these outfits. And then, and then you got people that, uh, um, that are not be living below the surface in the 3D, because that's what I call it. They're living, these are the low vibing energies that live below the surface in the 3D. And then you have those that live above the surface, right? Like they get it. They understand the mindset. They understand the power of words. They understand, they understand karma. They like, they get it. They don't have time to hate on people that haven't done anything. They, they're just, they just have so much time to watch them. And so they don't like their swag or they don't like their, 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 um, their confidence. But the, in all actuality, they do love their confidence and they do love their swag. And basically they've embodied the, the energy of jealousy, right? That's what they, with their free will, wanted to rock, right? So, <clears throat> so they're down, getting ready, and now the people on the surface, they're they're. <laughs> oh man, I love spiritually gifted people, right? Because they're always telling you what to watch out for. <laughs> so you know. A picture of this guy's in your head. You got these energies getting ready. And these are the, you know, these people got it going on, right? I mean, not just financially, but they got it going on, you know, eternally, which means everything before, you know, everything else comes. So they, you know, everything, they, they, they got it going on. They're having a conversation. They're all getting dressed. And then they're like, one energy, <laughs> one energy says to the other energy, hey, um, and it's like, it's two girls talking. She's like, hey, girl. <laughs> it's like, what's up? She's like, hey, uh, you know, uh, what you wearing tonight? She's like, oh, you know, I got me some uh, good luck shoes. And, you know, I got me some, you know, abundant, my abundant belt on. And, you know, I, I, I got me my, you know, my evil eye uh, necklace. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Why are you wearing all that? No, what, she's all, why you got the evil eye on? You know, because the evil eye is for protection, right? And she's all, well, you know, them people from, from below the surface all be trying to, always be trying to creep up here, try to wear that, or wear that fake smile, try to come in with that, hey, what's going on? You know, like they vibing in that high energy, <laughs> like they one of us. They, you know, they try to masquerade. You know, they go down to the thrift store and they, and they, and they go look for, uh, one of them masquerade outfits that, you know, they could probably stay, stay posing as a high energetic person for, you know, 15 minutes or a short period of time, you know, before they're exposed that, okay, nah, you low vibing. <laughs> so because of that, right? She's like, girl, shoot. Uh, she's like, what kind of perfume you wearing? She says, some stay off me 3D people. <laughs> She rocking that stay off me 3D, 3D people perfume. She said, yeah, shoot. I don't know when they may show up. <laughs> Disguising like they're high vibing. Shoot, I got some. Stay off of me. <laughs> the other one was like, shoot, I got some banish me spray. <laughs> if I just think they, if I just, if I just, Think that, that they coming from below the surface, trying to holler at me. Psst, I'm spraying. <laughs> 
get off me and banish me spray. I'm telling you, man. I love it, guys. I love it. I'm having a great time this morning. Oh, man, that's funny, man. I mean, that download was given to me today, this morning. And what it's just funny because God was just showing me. You got people upset with people for no reason, no legitimate reason. And then at the same time, they want me to bless them. <laughs> and then the craziness is they be jealous and envious over the person that they're stalking, watching, whatever. And, and yet and still, you know, but they're like, you know, instead of putting on an outfit of appreciation, instead of putting on that, but, you know, embodying that energy of appreciation and embodying that energy of, 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 um, you know, just positivity. Or things will get better for that person, for me, you know, for her, for whoever it is. They decide, that, let me see, let me wear this. And then what outfit I'm going to put on? I'm going to wear this sweater of, I got to rock my hater gear, girl. You know, I got my hater gear on today. I ain't smiling at nobody. Nobody ain't getting no smiles today. I mean mugging everybody. And you know, I look ugly when I mean mug. I mean mugging everybody. <laughs> Well, my hair's done and I look good <coughs> and, and, and I <laughs> it's just crazy and the same for the guys you know what I'm saying you know I've watched five rap videos I think I'm a player <laughs> it's like yeah I'm a player bro you know yeah I can get anybody dude yeah I was with this married chick last night, bro. Yeah, man. Her husband came home, man. Almost caught me. Yeah, man. You're like, and hey, that's your life? <laughs> You're like, and what part do I supposed to be like, oh, man, that's tight. <laughs> But see, that's a 3D below the service cover, uh, conversation. <laughs> you, you know, that, 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 that's how their conversations go pretty much like that. Yeah, bro. I almost got caught cheating last night, man. <laughs> really, bro? Yeah. Yeah, man. Shh. How about you? Nah, my girl still don't know, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I got her under a different name. You're like, <laughs> Oh, wow. You're like, so this is, this is the energy you, you, you wanted to wear. This is who you want to be. This is who empowers you. This is, this is empowering. <laughs> this is bringing out your best life, your, your, your best you. And then, hey, you know my saying, if you like it, I love it for you because I ain't going to have to reap none of the negative. <laughs> Because you know there's negative this. There's all kinds of negatives that come with that one. And then because then you go find the right one, right? Let me show you how God plays this game. And then you go do all that, right? Cheat, break relationships, break up homes, whatever. And it takes two people to do all this, right? So, you know, you get people to play along. Let's play. Okay. And so, you know, they embody these energies. But keep in mind, folks, these are all people living below the surface and below the surface in this 3d realm these with their free will they're just like look man i can go up there but i don't want to go up there to stay up there we like to go up there to the surface just like to see what it would feel like like hey, hey you know these people live high vibing up here like you know they vibe high <laughs> Like, like, and you know, they can spot you. You got everybody up here got spiritual gifts. Everybody's gifted. <laughs> Everybody's gifted. <laughs> like they friends up here. Like, look, one energy, one energy talks to another energy, right? But they're talking um, above the surface, right? So they're all high vibing. And he's like, man, I remember when I was living down in the 3D world before, you know, I woke up. He's all, man, I remember I would say whatever. He goes, I knew I was waking up, right, bro? He's all, how did you know? He said, because I would always be like looking at my looking at my surroundings, looking at the life I was living and going like, I know for a fact it has to be better. It has to get better. 
There has to be more to life than just this. Like I was not created, made, invented, born, whatever you want to call it for this. Like, yeah, you were just made to just <laughs> to be ratchet. <laughs> yeah, I've been wearing that outfit for a while, bro. <laughs> Yeah, man. What kind of cologne you wear? Yeah, man. Back then in the day, shoot, you know, I used to, I used to rock that. <laughs> I used to rock that. I'm unfaithful as all get out. <laughs> hey, let me get some of that too. We used to be in the bathroom spraying that on each other. Hey, you got that unfaithful? I got that unfaithful as all get out. I'd be like, yeah, let me get some of that. Yeah, let me get some of that heartbreak. I'll never stick around. Yeah, let me see. Let me get some of that heartbreak. I'll never stick around cologne. <laughs> Uh, oh, God, help us all. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh. Yeah, let me get some of that illusion. Yeah, what are you wearing tonight? I'm wearing illusion, girl. I'm wearing illusion because I'm a straight up illusion. <laughs> Nothing about me is real. <laughs> I am an illusion. <laughs> Everything is fake on me. <laughs> Even my mindset. It's all broken. <laughs> but how do I look? <laughs> That's when right there you're going to find out if you got a friend or a foe. If she be like, girl, you look good. <laughs> you look good with them, with them, with that, with that pride jacket <laughs> and that illusion outfit on and them ego shoes. Oh, you killing them. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> oh, gosh. Man, I tell you. It's crazy, right? That is crazy. Crazy, crazy. So, anyway, you're, he's talking about, you know, all this going on below the surface to his friend, right? I know I got off track probably. But anyway, I'm having fun. So, it is what it is. So, anyway, he's, he's telling his friend, like, man, about just how it used to be when he was lost, you know, living in a 3D underworld, you know, I mean, uh, uh, below the surface with everybody else that just had like that ratchet type of thinking, you know what I mean? <laughs> if I can get away with it, I'll get away with it. If I can burn you, I'll burn you. If I can cheat, I'll cheat. If I can lie to you, I'll lie to you. If I can, you know what I'm saying? It was just, it hit the eyes, the eyes. Everything was all self, self, self. You know, the world of selfishness. That whole energy, that whole world is embodied, the sky, the everything is all embodied with an energetic shield. It's like, like a dome and they all live under it and that frequency of that dome keeps them all energetically low vibing until they figure out that they can get past the dome that they've been living under with all the other people that are all low vibing, that all want to get out, right? <laughs> <clears throat> but they just don't know it. So, and some do. So he's talking about just all this stuff that's going on. And he's like, I've always said, man, like, when I get up there to um, above the surface, He's all, I'm going to have a whole new set of friends, man. I like, he was on a whole new mindset. And his, and his friend, the other energy, was like, what kind of, what do you mean a whole new set of friends? Like, what? He's all high energy? He goes, no, nah, man, not just high energy. He goes, forget all this. I've been all these years down here. I want friends. He goes, let me tell you, for instance. He goes, I got a friend named Peter that if he shakes your hand, he can tell you what you did last night. Friends like that. All spiritual, powerful, gifted friends. So now when you're sitting out, so he says, so now when I'm going out having dinner, my friends are able to watch my back. It's like spiritual security bodyguards. And you're able to do the same for them. Everybody was able to watch other people, able to shake hands and read people, able to look at you and tell you, what your aura is. What color aura is around you? Are you a threat? Or are you just 3D? 
You know what I'm saying? But you're no threat. And he was like, man, you own some like superhero type. He's like, look, bro, why wouldn't I not be? Why would I not be? If imagination creates reality, if all this exists, he goes, why wouldn't I want friends that I can tell that I can communicate telepathically with? Why wouldn't I want that? I don't just want high vibing. That's great. But to me, that's just the beginning to a whole smorgasbord of endless gifts and opportunities that you can explore. And I love to explore, period. And so he told the, 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 the other energy this, and his partner was like, dude, that's what's up. He said, look at you. Talking about that's what's up. He said, look at your gifts. And he's all, look, you're clairvoyant. You got gifts. And he didn't even really look at himself like that. He just took it as being normal because he was clairvoyant, clair audio. And then he looked at it different, like, wow. Never thought about it like that. So that is a trip. Everybody... Everybody in our circle's gifted. So we can all watch each other, protect each other, and read everyone. Because you never know. <laughs> you know, when they go down to that Salvation, the Salvation Army store, and I don't mean the actual one because I'm putting no negative seed on the Salvation Army. They do great work. So, and so does the thrift store. I'm just throwing a name out there, guys. But I'm saying when they go where they go, okay? <laughs> they get their bootleg outfit, right? <laughs> or they get their little bootleg spray that says like high vibrational spray will work only for 30 minutes before it wears off. <laughs> and they're trying to cover up the illusion that they're rocking that day, right? Because they got the illusion on. They're not really who they look like. They're not really who they say they are. And so they, 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 they spray the high vibrational. I'm high vibrational today spray on. <laughs> and then they hurry up and try to go to the surface. So they could just see what sunlight looks like. Freedom looks like. Love looks like. True love. You know what I'm saying? What joy looks like. Is it heaven? No, it's not heaven. But it's a sense of heaven on earth because you're not dealing with all the drama that they're dealing with. You know what I'm saying? You're not having the mindset they're dealing with. You're not dealing with the ratchet lifestyle that they're dealing with, right? So in a sense, they've created their own hell on earth. And I guess they're waiting to go. I don't know. I don't know. But they've created their own hell on earth, right? And they don't. No, they create it because they're under that dome and energetically they're just all low vibing at the lowest low. <clears throat> so they don't know. It's like mind control. And, um, you know, and then you got those at the surface that broke free, the third eye. I don't know how it works out. I don't know if there's like a beam that shoots through. You know, the dome ever, you know, every so many hours or weeks or months or days. And by the way, if anybody's using this for a movie, I want my, I want my, my dividends, folks. <laughs> okay, let me keep going. Anyway, I don't know if there's like a beam that shoots down and then boom, just like, okay, you're chosen today. Like there's so many people that get chosen, right? To wake up. Like, you know, enough of, enough is enough. You've, you've been living your illusion <laughs> long enough of thinking it'll never work out. That's an illusion. Of thinking I'll never find love. That's an illusion. Of thinking, um, everybody's dying from this virus. That's an illusion. You know how many people are wearing fear today? So many people wear fear. Fear is one of the hottest outfits right now on the market, guys. And coming down the runway right now, we got our models and they're all going to be rocking our guys and girls. They're going to be showing you the latest gear in 2022. It's called Fear. 
false evidence appearing real. But when you put it on, it feels real to you. <laughs> it's no longer an illusion. It becomes very real in your reality. <laughs> Until you just take it off and you find out that it was never real. <laughs> so, so many people are wearing fear. Fear to move on, fear to leave a job, fear to find a new relationship, fear of um, of they're going to die, fear of getting sick, fear of never getting well. Um, people just have fear, you know, whatever somebody else did to them due to their poor, bad choices. And then they'll want to put what that person did to them. And bring it to someone that has not done nothing and put that on you. Like here, you wear, this is, I, I, I never got rid of the toxic person. So here, I, I kept a shirt. Here, you wear it. So you can always remind me of what was crushing me because I still hold on to, you know, like I want to feel that. That hurt. I want to, you know, you got people that are like that, you know. <laughs> I'm not happy because I'm just not happy. <laughs> I'm not happy. I want to feel pain, uh, or I want to fight. You know what I'm saying? I want to fight, and then I'm, and then we're good. After we fight, and then we're good. Okay, I'm cool now. <laughs> You're like, what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you wearing today? Is that called some kind of crazy? <laughs> You're like, girl, I wear some, I got some kind of crazy on today. <laughs> I'm wearing some kind of crazy. That's what I'm rocking, boy. This is the new designer. See, this is the designer that nobody knows about because it's in the spiritual realm. So, unless... You're in the 5D realm, unless you're higher than what you can see, feel, touch, and taste. And then you'll never know. But you'll be wearing this outfit too. Trust me, you went and you you made your purchase. Whether you know it, whether you know it or not, you have made your purchase. Whether you know it or not, you've made your purchase. And you, you're rocking this same outfit. You're rocking. You're, I mean, you went shopping. You went shopping. You went shopping either either at the high vibing mall, or you went shopping, you know, at the three D, you know, low vibe low vibing mall. And it might look pretty. Don't get me wrong. Uh, don't 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 get it twisted. The low vibing three D world be off the chain, glitz and glitter, lights. I mean, people looking nice, dressed. Up. I'm telling you, they even have those 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 colognes and perfumes smelling so good. Illusion. Oh, smells great. <laughs> Till it wears off. <laughs> you be like, Sally, uh, Rico. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was an illusion. <laughs> Oh, man. I thought you loved me. It was an illusion. It wore off. I know. <laughs> For that day, I did. For that night, I did. <laughs> oh, you bought into it? Hook, line, and sinker? Are you serious? You bought into it. You know, you know, we all wearing this. You know, we all wearing this spray. You know, we all, you know, we're all wearing this clothing. You know, we're all wearing this. Let me go to church. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. And now let me try to steal your inheritance. You're like, what the heck? <laughs> what you wearing today? You know, I got that hypocrisy on. You know what I'm saying? This that hot. This is that newest stuff. It just came out. I think I'm like one of the first ones that got it. Yeah. Yeah, it's called hypocrisy. Yeah, that's all good. And uh, I mix that girl with that, or or I mix that bro. I, I I'm rocking a, a hypocrisy today, bro. Ego shoes, and um, I got that illusion uh cologne on, bro. I got them all messed up today. They ain't gonna they ain't gonna see me coming, bro. Or when I'm leaving, they're just gonna be left heartbroken. <laughs> Ah, 
Man, I can go on and go on. I feel amazing, man. I feel good. I don't let people get to me for too long. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you can touch me, <clears throat> then that's your loss. That's because then I actually felt something. You know what I'm saying? And a person like me on your team, <laughs> trust me, it's someone to have on your team. Because how many people can you trust, right? So when you can walk away from that, when you can embody that energy to just look at people like that, like a dime a dozen or, 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 you know, not see their value. And then it's not their loss. Once again, that's God stepping in, protecting that person because that's the person of high value. And the other person just gets thrown illusion. <laughs> Even God get in the game. <laughs> He'd be like, shoot, let me get in here. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me get in here. Let me throw some illusions. Bam! <laughs> Have you all jacked up? <laughs> throw a tower in your life. Boom, you're like, oh, man. Oh, yeah, we got them really going now, huh? <laughs> It's like driving in your car with a bad alignment with a bad alignment. Your car's just shaking. But you're still driving. <laughs> oh man, if you had <laughs> if you had milk in a cup, it'll be a milkshake by the time you get out. <laughs> your car's just shaking. <laughs> That's like a lot of people's lives, right? <laughs> They're like, I'm not dead. No, but your car is just shaking your life. Your life is like on a bad alignment. <laughs> it ain't going right either. <laughs> yeah, you're getting to where you got to get to. Yeah, I got to I got to work. I got to my destiny. But how was the ride? <laughs> how did you get there? Is that what you're willing to put up with every day? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm going to wear this outfit today. Which one do you wear? I'm going to put on that, um, I want to put on, uh, let me see. I'm going to put on that, uh, it's just what it is. I'm going to wear those, it's just what it is shoes. I'm going to put my, it's just what it is. It's, you know, it's just what it is. I don't have no say over life. I have no say over my life. It's just what it is. I'm going to put those low vibrational, it, it is what it is shoes on. And then I'll rock that, um, nobody cares belt. And uh, I'm gonna. What kind of cologne am I gonna put? What kind of perfume am I gonna put? I'm gonna put on that. Uh, um, let me see. I don't trust nobody perfume. Yeah, okay. Because of my previous bad choice I made, I want to blame other people now and put walls up. Go ahead, put them walls up. <laughs> put a wall up. <laughs> Make a monument. <laughs> Matter of fact, make a cocoon and hide off in it. <laughs> Have you like you still in the war pulling the trigger with no bullets in it? And you don't know it's been over for a hundred years already. <laughs> oh man, what energy are you embodying today people where are you living mentally today people are you yes we're all here in the 3d world but you know god says we're supposed to be in this world but not of it yeah we benefit from it the luxuries uh the the, the uh, from our fruit and our hard work or you know we, we we reap our our you know from all of our hard work our fruit and our labor, you know, we get we 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 get to enjoy life. I get it. But how many people are enjoying life? How many people are happy? How many relationships? And you know, there and you, you know the relationships. You can tell they're just breeding other other uh, 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 the the next generation to be the same. Why? Because they're already starting off cheating, right? You're like, dude, sixteen, bro. Yeah, I got like three girlfriends. <laughs> Like, oh, you're tight, bro. <laughs> and then you're looking at the girls like, who are the girls that are actually low vibing? That's like, yeah, 
I know he's not really treating me right, but I'm just going to hang in there. Like, okay, where did you get that from? <laughs> it's like, see how it gets passed down? <laughs> and now look how early it starts at, right? It's crazy, right? It's crazy. I mean, if you can have the opportunity to, to empower somebody, to give them a better life, and then you choose to use your time and energy to try to deplete them of their energy, rob them of their gifts, um, put them on hold, make them feel like they're nobody, you know, be selfish to other people. It's all about you. It's all about me. I don't like this. And I don't think this is right. And um, you can tell selfish people because the first thing come out of their mouth is always I. <laughs> Man, I, I I don't think this is right. I don't really like the way they did me. I don't I don't this. I don't I don't that. I I I I I I I. You be like, wow, really? <laughs> you be like. Uh, the other girl would be talking to the other girl energy and say, uh, girl, why are you reaching in your purse? She's all, oh, nothing. And she pull out some banish me spray. Psh, get away from me. <laughs> you are an imposter. You ain't no high vibing one of us. Psh, get away from me. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I was going to record this, but then I was like, oh, whatever. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to do like a podcast and, um, and just speak my mind like I always do. And those that hear it, those are, are the ones that were meant to hear it. <laughs> but it is the truth. It is the truth because I have no time to play games, lie, be an illusion, make up stories. And then reap all that negative karma in my life. And then I end up looking like those people that live below the surface in the 3D world. Are you serious? No. I've been through too much. I've made it through too much. I have victory over too much. They try to deplete me, take me down, take me out. <laughs> na, 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 na. <laughs> I'm wearing that I am cologne every day. <laughs> I am whatever I want to be. That's what I am. That's what I am. I am always wearing that I am cologne, and it's a, and it always it's always followed up followed up with a line of uh, positivity. Today's a wonderful day. Um, I expect something good to come my way today. Um, you know what I'm saying? That's what my cologne cabinet looks like. I'm always rocking that good stuff. And then I have that banish you spray. Stay away from me spray. <laughs> come across my path with that junk again. And I'll make sure you never cross my path again. <laughs> we rocking that kind of spray in this high vibing world. We want to make sure we keep you up. We want to keep you guys off of us. <laughs> Until you ready to act right. Nah, we're going to spot it every time. But on that note, guys, I've had fun. You guys are all amazing. We've all been in that low energy. So, hey, I'm just having fun with it. But <clears throat> we do have a lot of people living there that don't want to get out. They still think the war is on. They're in the closet pulling the trigger. And you're knocking on the door. It's over, Grandpa. The war's over. <laughs> Stop pulling the trigger. No. Don't open the back door. <laughs> They're still coming. <laughs> and your friends are looking at you like, are you serious? <laughs> Like, are you serious? Is he for real? <laughs> he has a war hat on, <laughs> an army jacket for teeth, <laughs> a rifle with no bullets pulling the trigger. <laughs> Talking about, <laughs> it, it just got real.
<laughs> and outside of him, outside of him, right outside the closet, there's people playing, there's kids, they're, they're running around, they're laughing. Basically, there's life going on. Real life. A happy life. An enjoyable life. But you can keep yourself stuck in the closet like that guy. Or you can embody a clown suit and entertain people like me. Or you can just look in the mirror and decide to make a change and embody that self-empower, that power that you have already in you. Those gifts that you have in you, bring them out. Become the rising phoenix. Become who you supposed to be and get all that you supposed to get living in that energy and not be like so many unfortunate people that will live and die and never love themselves, never knew themselves. And on that note, guys, I'm sure you guys are all amazing. And it is a wonderful, super Saturday blue skies out here. It looks amazing. I love it. I'm in nature. I love it. I love it. Hug a tree, guys. Exchange some energy. Oh, you don't know about that? Want me to teach you that? Want me to show you how to do that? <laughs> you know, you know, nature is perfect. Energy, it's God. It's God. You ever see a tree cheat God out of the leaves? No, it's always going to yield everything that it's supposed to yield when it's supposed to yield it. It doesn't say he's not looking, so I'm only going to give you a few. It always lives to its full potential. So it's perfect, good energy. Hug a tree. Close your eyes. Say, you give me what I need, and I'm going to exchange, and I'm going to give you good energy. And do it. Or don't do it. <laughs> Either way, I'm out of here. I got these to do. People to heal, uplift, motivate, encourage. And, 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 and yeah, and I'm wearing all that today too. So if you guys see me out there, I got some uplifting. I'm rocking some encouragement. I got some, I'm protected by all of heaven. I got some, uh, I'm, I'm powerful. I got, yeah, I'm rocking. My, my, my outfit is extremely expensive. <laughs> it's all designered out, handmade by God himself, by the universe himself. Yeah. He said, look, chosen one, this is what I want you to put on today. <laughs> Walk in your power. You've earned it. I'm out. Peace. <laughs>